Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome to today's video where I will be taking this beautiful Ferrari 458 Italia and customizing it and upgrading it to see what it can do. Let's get right into it. Now, the Ferrari 458 Italia is pretty kind of special to me because it's like the first Ferrari that I actually like, started liking. Like, I knew Ferrari as a brand, but I never really like, looked at their cars. But after I saw the 458, I was like, oh, wow, okay. And then I started liking Ferraris. It's going to cost $115,000. This is going to be about 300, 300 pounds. It's going to be about 3,000 pounds with 1,215 horsepower. And it's going to be S2 at 950. So kind of like mid S2 range, 950. Finished customizing the car and doing all the upgrades and stuff. Now, I, I mean, I didn't do a whole lot. I changed, basically all I did was just change the rims out. And then paint the brake calipers. And tint the windows. That's, that's really, it's really basic. But... I didn't really, I didn't really know what else to do besides like the Ferrari red, and I feel like especially since like this like the first Ferrari that I created in the, or that I customized in this game, I wanted to kind of keep it like the original kind of, I guess like Ferrari look, or the classic kind of Ferrari look. But now I'm gonna be curious to see how this thing drives, cause it's got 1,200 horsepower V10 in here. Do a little launch right here. Let's get some kick! Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and go to the classic uh, drag strip down here. And of course, go through the tunnels, of course. Uh, cause I, like to, I like to start off with that to get a little good overview of what the car is gonna be like. Alright, I'm now approaching the tunnels. Right, I have a feeling this this thing's gonna do pretty well. Let's see. I got a little slower launch, but that's okay. Cause I got the power. There we go. Leaving everybody behind. Uh, it's got to finish at 252. Time of 21.1. Alright, so I found a circuit that I'm gonna go ahead and do. And it's, it looks good, it has a good little straightaway and stuff in it too, so. Alright, now I think the 458 is gonna handle really well. Because the way I've been driving around the, or when I've been driving it around the map, I've been really happy with it. Like, it's, it's like barely gotten squirrely on me. And now I'm gonna say that, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose control in the race. Oh, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, I, I tapped the wall, but I didn't hit it. Got a little slide there. Ah, oh, I lost my skill score. Kind of having trouble passing people. Hey, don't hit me. Oh, 
fucking dirty racing move right there. Uh, I don't know why I said that's so country. I don't know why sometimes when I record, my my like country voice comes out. It's really weird. All right, almost made our uh, past third. About to say almost made our way up to third. Okay, that was horrible, horrible. My mind saw the turn and said, "Nah, we don't need a break. We're just gonna hit the wall. That's what we're gonna do. That's a good idea." I got third again. Oh, don't, don't, don't lose it now. Hey, okay, not in third anymore. I'm battling this GTR right now. But I need to get up there. And we only have like one corner left, so I don't think it's gonna happen. Unless I get a miracle. At the corner, or second. Uh, oh, that was really close. That was that was a good race though. I'm I'm happy with the race. Even though I didn't win. It was really close though. It was exciting. Alright, so I found a sprint race I'm gonna do. 4.3 miles. It's going by the water. I think it'd be a cool one. Right, that, it's kinda weird how it switched to night, even though it's not a street race. I don't think that happened. That's I don't think that's happened to me before. Yeah, I think it's gonna handle really well, like it did in the circuit race. And uh, this gonna have the extra, or well, should have the extra horsepower to pass. But it looks like they're actually leading me. That's kind of weird. But it seems like to be, it seems like it's fast in the corners, which is a good thing. As long as I break for him, I don't know why my brain like sometimes just shuts down in the corner. It drives me crazy. I'm keeping up with the with the guy in first. Oh, I barely got that checkpoint. A little risky there. A little squirrely on me. Oh my goodness, I gotta regain control. Come on now. This race is getting close to being over. Don't fall apart, please. I don't think I can pass. No. No, I'm gonna retry it. Cause I feel like I could have done a lot better. Now towards the end with those kind of quick corners, I just seemed like I, I was, I was kind of butchered. So I'm gonna try it again. All right, I got. I have more confidence this time. Some bad shifting. I passed the big pack though. Back to the guy in first. Oh, hello, 4GT. Good to see you. Okay, I gotta come in here with some more composure this time.
Taking these corners a lot slower, but it seems like I'm doing better because I'm not like losing traction. I got like 15% left, and I feel so strong. There we go. Now I feel like I don't I don't remember what the time was from the first race. I feel like I did a lot better the second race. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for today's video. Uh, definitely liking this car a lot. So if you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you all later.